our Diet Dr. Peppers this morning. We're back to the Yay. Caleb clap. He's recovered enough that he He's can clap. He's not that broken anymore. That is so exciting. You notice anything different about me, yeah? Pink earphones. Oh, you're bald now. No, I With don't. those pink earphones and your natural skin complexion. And, I think you and this isn't not a this too. isn't like a this isn't a dig or anything mean. Just go ahead. You look like a cartoon pig. <laughs> yeah, no, that's not mean. And this isn't a dig or mean or anything either, but you smell like shit today. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Jubia, do you want to unmute? You have anything to say to me today? No, he says he doesn't no. want no. to. Okay. Jubia, what's that last thing? What's that recommendation there? <laughs> Recommended on our thing. What have you been looking up? Oh, Why hey. is that recommended to you? That's what are you based are you, on your are you on act, your searches? I don't think it is. I think that's just a fucking news story. Oh, that's just a news story. You're acting like the only <laughs> people that ever read anything about Hitler are like people who are googling Hitler all day. Yeah, and I think that's what Jubio's doing. You think he sits on the work computer? You think he sits on Caleb's <laughs> computer? Yeah. Like yeah. computer. Yeah. <laughs> I think, yeah, what are you talking about? It's just a news story. What do you <laughs> well, mean? He, he's not going to look it up on his own computer. <laughs> then people will get mad at him when he types in H in Google and that pops up first. That's true. Everybody in South America. Oh, my God. Yep. You're done for Cameron's again. It's cable. fucking over. There it's must over be an ele- like one of those, you know, like the ghost in the machine from that Scooby-Doo movie, the electricity ghost. You guys do a two-guy thing. Okay. <laughs> and I still have a hard time turning to the right, so yeah. this is tough. So I'll, yeah, I'm you've gonna got do a fucked up neck still. I'm just gonna do this. That is, kind of that, is that must suck. Can you imagine so bad. if you and me just had a, our own podcast where we just kind of like looked at each other in the mm-hmm. eyes like this and talked? We've done it a few times. What would we? Do? They're probably pretty bad. Right? I think we. Well, I was audited for Scientology. Oh, I would do that. Was fun. That was actually a fire. That ass was really episode. fun. Yeah, so did we never did like pre though. We never did like uh like pre like pandemic or whatever. We never did like just us. You it was me, always just me yeah, and Yeah, you Cam. and me never just sat down and yeah. just talked. You and there me. was only one mommy's gone episode. Yeah. When mommy was gone. Mommy was not around. Mommy's uh-huh. right mommy now busy. Mommy's got the belt and mommy's gonna <laughs> 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 Mommy's gonna hit us with it's the belt. It's scary right now. that what uh-huh. mommy's doing. When mommy gets that belt up, you know, I get scared. I went to New England this weekend uh-huh. and I think i miss new england so i'm literally so, i'm so much, so dude. excited to open new england is so much better than new york i yeah dude, I i'm so I excited to do that show trillion. in boston we went to this bar i literally i need to go back so bad i miss it there. i want to go to the tam i want to recreate that fucking video you the have three to. guys are screaming the f we, word we went to this bar <laughs> and there was a um uh it was like it wasn't even that late it was like 11 o'clock and uh-huh. there was this guy we, we got there and there's a, there was a band playing there's a pool table, and there's two guys playing pool. One of them is like an old guy, like you know, guys who are so old that they just look they have they have like black eyes permanently. Yeah, you know, they yeah. just have like purple around their yeah, eyes. They just like, have stuff. Yeah, it's yeah. really all old. the throwing up they do every morning. It's got to be that. Yeah, it just popped blood vessels yeah. from like trying to remember yeah. a birthday. And then <laughs> this guy, he's sitting there, and he has like uh, he has a predator, like a really nice pool cue. And he sucks, bro. This old man <laughs> yeah. was fucking terrible. I've yeah. never seen a worse pool player. But he was playing against this amazing, like, 35-year-old guy with skin like a wallet who's just, like, was the drunkest I've ever seen anybody be. Just like a mm-hmm. bar stool, like, New England guy. Yeah. And mm-hmm. this guy would go down. He would miss a shot. And then he would just start dancing. Just like, ooh, ooh, like, right in the old man's face. And they didn't know each other. So he's just this random oh guy God. that he's playing him, and <laughs> it was yeah, making yeah, me, it was like it was like a fucking nightmare. It was like a nightmare where you can't like where you try to you get in a fight and you your punches yeah, go in slow yeah. motion because it was like you want this guy to lose so badly, and the guy that he's playing looks like he'd be a great pool <laughs> uh, player, yeah. but he's just the guy was like like uh, yeah. choosing to shoot the wrong ball every time. The old man, oh he was fucking, he didn't go over. I'm and imagining coach him? now a a, no. n- a nightmare where yeah, I'm playing pool and I'm horrible. I'm losing to this guy. Yeah. And he's dancing in my face. And it's like this horrible nightmare. And right when I think I can't get any worse, I look down at my hands and they're all like arthritic. And yeah. All <laughs> yeah, no, that guy oh was my God, living I'm also 90 years an old. actual fucking yeah. nightmare. His dementia. He freak, he th- thinks he still thinks he's 16. Yeah. at the bar. He was like, oh he was. Oh you, you know, you know how one. sad it is when an old guy is like still 
doesn't really have it together. Yeah. And they're like kind of like they it's clear that they're like yeah. ordering food and they're a little nervous or something. No, it's <laughs> yeah. like, like an old man with social anxiety. He never actually makes it up. me yeah. that makes me so sad. Dude, bro. it's so fucked. It's like how is he not oh, having you know what's even French onions? No. Yeah. Oh, I'm panic ordering. You know You're what's fucking even, 80. What's, uh, same similar thing what? when an old person is like a hoarder. But yeah. you can tell they didn't like become a hoarder because they got old. Uh-huh. Like they have stuff that's like they've just they've been like that. They've lived in a house filled with newspaper and yeah. beer oh, bottles yeah. since they were a kid. Scary. Yeah. It's yeah. just that like that's what they're used to. So yeah, they, that's like, it's not that they're it's not that that's like an old person thing. It's that they've been doing it for eighty years. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The idea of an old person like yeah going to Starbucks and having the person they're with order for them is like actually making me want to cry. <laughs> it's yeah. horrible. It's like the yeah. saddest thing I've ever even thought oh about. Oh my god. Well, and you, and yeah. uh, just like an 85 year old doing that but then both of their fingers break yeah <laughs> an 85 year old guy who goes to the movies and the guy's like enjoy the movie and he says you, you too. too and he's like oh no oh, crap. oh no well that's oh your thing is 80. old guys he's going home and he's he's dipping his quill in his inkwell and he's drawing a socially awkward penguin yeah, yeah. On a yeah it's our crumb, crumb. <laughs> <laughs> that is our crumb yeah <laughs> This guy was just like that, bro. He was like, well, yeah, that's he what kept I was like say. tripping over himself, and he like he tied his shoelaces uh. twice because they just came untied. Yeah. It's it's uh. just like old guys like that. Like if you were like a nerd in the fifties, you're like still you're like stuck more. With that. Yeah, you're like you're like our yeah. crumb though. You're like a, like a guy who's just very vindictive. And like just very like I fucking hate everybody. You know you know me. how in like you know how in like UHF. Uh, Weird Al is like the guy, and he like forgets his to go out to dinner with his girlfriend. Yeah. You know that like yeah. type of trope. That like an old guy who does that. I feel like usually that's like the old guy. You're like, oh, he's he's senile. He's and he doesn't care, and it's cool. Mm-hmm. But uh, an old guy who can achieve being that kind of like forget like somehow i'm imagining a, like an old guy who's forgetful but you can tell it's not dementia at all and that he's just like completely <laughs> yeah. just a just a, just a kind fuck of up a, yeah. yeah like a, imagine mr bean was like yeah. on like medicaid you know yeah. that <laughs> that's oh, you scary know he is now fucking old ass well probably Rowan yeah. yeah i don't think he's on medicaid yeah. i don't think he's an american citizen. well those no. old those there's like i think this is like he's a on new medicaid <laughs> <laughs> he's on the no. nhs no. That's like uh, that's just a new phenomenon, though. I don't think I don't old think people. old people are afraid that that's you're 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 in fear of the future where there's going to be old people like that for sure. Like old people ordering at restaurants are so confident. Yeah, that's what I mean. That's what's scary. That's because they like used to they, people with social anxiety back in the forties. They used to and and fifties and sixties and seventies used to string them up by their feet. And yeah, slit their throats. It's the same feeling <laughs> I have when I used to used to watch like a Larry King interview or whatever. And he's 98 years old, and all he talks about is how scared he is of dying. Yeah, yeah. it's like, bro, that's not what I want to hear when I'm a kid. No, yeah, it is. You are. I I'm feeling a fear that I never thought of before. Uh-huh. Yeah, it really is bothering me to think about an old like the way that I usually think about an old person being a fuck up is like, oh, he's like a. He's from a different time. Yeah. Like he's yeah. yeah, he's like he doesn't but he doesn't get how to interact with <laughs> yeah. his children or no, something. Yeah, yeah, no, like my great yeah, 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 so yeah. just literally yeah. <laughs> just yeah, oh my god. It's yeah. really terrifying. Uh, yeah. And those are like and now that I think about it, I think most old people are like that. Like no old people have it yeah. figured out really. Yeah. They just yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, I think a good chunk of them do. But like maybe even my grandpa, now I'm thinking back at like times when he just like said shit that made no sense and I'm yeah. like, "Oh, maybe he just got so like overwhelmed and kind of anxious <laughs> that he just was uh, weird." You know? Yeah. My uh, yeah, my damn. grandpa, I I mean, I talked about my grandpa just forgetting my name, but like I like that I think that there I think he's the the polar Maybe he's also opposite. just stupid. Like yeah. this yeah. idea of a stupid old person is pretty sad too. Yeah. I think it's right? the polar the polar opposite guy you're describing like the old man with social anxiety yeah this is like the jock the, the jock my, yeah, yeah, my the grandpa jock. that's what i'm saying my grandpa every, was like ah crisp whatever the fuck. every old guy i think they're the jock yeah, yeah me too every, I, just because yeah. of the way that their jocks, skin looks their wrinkles jocks uh-huh. usually live longer yeah, yeah. right yeah. the nerds kill themselves the yeah. jocks yeah, they live know how the scary the, the world jocks is. live the jocks spread their seed uh-huh. to generations uh-huh. right the jocks yeah. are the ones with all the grandkids yeah the nerds never fucked the nerds never got no damn no, pussy. They got sent overseas to mm-hmm. to do codes. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah they stayed in Vietnam. Yeah. Because yeah. they got there and they were like, <laughs> and they were like, do you oh guys my have god, anime? <laughs> yeah, wow, we should invent anime. I know it's the wrong country. Don't worry about it. 
<laughs> the nerds are over there, man. The nerds are still in <laughs> Vietnam. <laughs> And you know what the, the worst part about the nerds in Vietnam is, is that they they're the ner- they're making all these fucking foodie videos. They're like weeb. Well, they're like weebs for fucking Vietnam in the sixties. <laughs> they're like, oh my god, is that a hole in the ground wow. I can live in? That's amazing. <laughs> like crap. Oh my god. Yeah, they were like that though. I bet. Yeah, yeah, there was definitely a lot of people who probably just were. Uh, I think that there's a lot of soldiers with glasses in Vietnam. Do you guys ever yeah. think about if you got forced to go into the military, would you go MIA? Would you yeah. go AWOL? Dude, I would go AWOL immediately. I think I, I, think I would go AWOL. I would yeah. probably do surgery on myself and remove like I know my somebody, hamstrings or something. I know what somebody the fuck who are you talking about? Why? What? Oh, to get out of. Yeah. But what if they well, were like, anything? If I like break my leg, they're gonna be like, "You broke your leg." But uh-huh. they're not gonna believe. They're, I'm gonna say I was born without hamstrings, <laughs> and I just never <laughs> noticed until today. Yeah. Oh, and by the way, I I hurt both the backs of my legs recently. So if you see two little stitches, I, I uh, hit myself on a s- but razor then, scooter. But what if you fuck up, right? What if you go like Axel from Twisted see? Metal? You put your arms into some wheels, oh, yeah, and, and they're, they're like, like, "Yeah, you're your front line. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. we you actually want to own you." <laughs> <laughs> you actually will now be the prototype for every other person, That's right? That's true. I guess I would run away from the army unless the offer they're making me is that we want you to join the army and we're also going to clone your genome for eternity <laughs> and you're going to be the entire army is going to be you. Yeah. Do I you would do that in a heartbeat. Most famous guy in the world. Yeah. Do you think we'll ever be at a place You'd be where... be like Captain America. If you had wheels for arms and, like and a turret on your belly, hundred thousand Captain America. Yeah, you'd have a turret in wow. your belly that was like a Gatling gun. Wow, you'd be and rolling down the. And, and but the why? Would, and then we would, a, we would, uh, we would fucking, we would, we'd go to the bar after. We'd take out the whole bar. Everyone's, everyone's out. Because mm, you can't kill them. Fire, just, we, well, we wouldn't kill them. You we can't just stop get shooting out of the here. belly gun. But you we would just, just imagine every time out, you breathe in and out, it's shooting a new bullet. Just imagine you go to the bar on the base. The military base, oh, yeah. and it's just all you. Damn, yeah. Yeah. Hey, just yeah. all singing yeah. Irish drinking songs. All buying it. <laughs> Everyone trying to say, "I'll buy you the next round." Yeah, yeah. everything oh in God. unison. Yeah. I'll buy you the next round. <laughs> 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 do you guys ever think this is a terrifying concept? Okay, if you're, you're if you're if you love violence, do you ever think that all of our wars will be fought in virtual reality? No. No, well, because. Um, you're good. It's like because I'm kind of like, training for that. It's like when you play with a cat with like a laser pointer, right? They they don't feel fulfilled because they didn't have something they could like sink their teeth into or their claws and like pretend that they're killing. Because they think it's a ladybug. Yeah, yeah. You're they right. think Here's it's what, a bug that they're chasing, but it's not. It's just a little red dot. True. Here's what I'll say, and this is a little bit maybe of a history lesson. Um, but you guys are gonna need it because wars. Need the, it. the soldiers. They have all. I think the soldiers have always been there. Those are the stupid guys, and they just say, "You guys can fight each other. We don't. Whatever. You guys mm. go out there. With your, you guys. You will just send you over there to fight. You go play outside. Mm. Why do they but always the send real, the poor? But the, why do they always send the poor? The real wars. Because they're worse. The real. What it's always been. It's about spies. What? And the spies are the top level, and the spies are going True. back and forth and stealing documents and yeah. stealing cars and stealing paintings and back and forth. They're opening and up the that show, I guess. is and exactly. <laughs> And then putting it away. My knowledge of spies, and that is what will move online. The soldiers there never mattered. My, yeah. my, the war, that part of the war is is nothing. My whole knowledge of spies, everything I know, is that there's a black guy and a white guy, and they're yeah. trying to give each other a bomb. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Is that? Yeah, I actually is that, re- is I had that a true? whole book about that as a kid. Yeah, yeah, and some of it was a little gory. Yeah, did you ever read those? I spy wish I ever versus like spy that. versus spy. I read all yeah. the spy versus spy. I was obsessed was with spy versus spy as a kid. I did. I loved spy versus spy. Spy in the Mad magazines. Yeah, I had that. I what had. I had the like anthology of all the spy Ooh. versus spy, and they had a bunch of. It was all. They're all funny. Yeah. Mm-hmm. First of all, but uh, they had a bunch. They had the thing where they do like guest artists or whatever, mm-hmm. and there are a bunch that were like really gory. Like really, really nasty, yeah. yeah like guest artists Rob, would do all these like, really Leafield. detailed. Did they ever do like a reverse cowgirl? Sex thing where you see the, the spies hell are you on about? Cock squeeze into the other spy's fucking asshole Almost and definitely. it stretches butt cheeks apart. What are you talking about? Like this, and he's looking back at the camera, like, yeah, like, uh, yeah, and they're fucking. No. The guy who made Spy vs. Spy like escaped from Cuba or something. That and makes really, sense. Yeah, and he was like, I what need to make, sc- <laughs> I need to make Spy. No, yeah, he was like, he like, he, w- he hated Castro. Oh. And he was like, I need to make this to show people what it's like. That's what it was like there. <laughs> Just passing bombs back and forth. 
Wow. I could be completely wrong about that because the last time that I <laughs> no, 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 you remember learning keep, about that is yeah. when I was maybe eight years no, old. No, next time you're in a Barnes and Noble and a kid is reading a spy versus spy thing, you should walk up and be like, "Did you know this is based on Cuba?" Well, I remember, I remember yeah. the anthology having at least at the very least they talked about Castro in the like in the like intro or whatever, yeah. and where there was something about how he hated Castro. Was and spy I was like, versus spy? Oh. Was that all in Mad Magazine? Yeah, yeah, that's when it, where it was. Yeah. yeah. Man, that was one fucking crazy magazine. I think miss dude. that so much. I miss Don't act getting. Like, what are you? Talking? I miss getting them for Easter. I'd never got them at any. You other were time never of the year. alive at a time when Mad Magazine was like a big thing. It wasn't a big thing, they but they like made Mad it. Kids magazine. Yeah. I know like, they made it, but it was the, terrible when we the had Mad it. Kids. When I was version? a kid, it was good because I was a kid and I didn't know that it was bad. Uh, no, I mean that's like like uh, I still you got to see that your first fold in the fucking you, in the okay, back. but wouldn't you be a little pissed off if like a fourteen year old now is like I love Smosh? No, yeah, you'd be a little that bit like a little weird. You don't know it what, would be weird. You don't know Smosh. I had my dad. No, because that's it. all that's videos. That's videos from. But back if they were saying, but but still, say they were saying, I love Smosh. I love the fucking when they. I love the girls in Smosh. Oh, you'd be then, like, yeah. what girls? Okay, good point. Right? Yeah. yeah, the Mad Magazine we grew up with was bullshit. You know, yeah. they had some good. Stuff. I had my my about Obama. My dad had. They used to. They had. They put a lot of the Mad Magazine stuff into just paperbacks. Yeah, like collecting uh-huh. stuff, and I, he had a bunch of old ones of those, so I would always read those. And those were fire. Do you guys sometimes those feel really like you good. were half raised in the 2000s and half <laughs> raised in the 1980s? Yes. A little bit because of your media a diet? A little bit because yeah. right? of my taste Cause in Because I was walking around in in my life and I was people. I was going to school saying, yeah, my favorite movie is you know, Mel Brooks. Yeah. Mel Brooks movies. My favorite movie is the Mel Brooks totally. The Mel Brooks films. Yeah, and I was like, my favorite movie is Yu-Gi-Oh! the movie. You, I remember yeah. I said to somebody, I said, I love Young Frankenstein. And they said, oh, is that a rapper? Oh, I shit. Said, dude, psh- I ought to fucking no, shoot you. No, it's the most head. terrifying movie ever made. Yeah, it's actually a really fucking. And you scary, wouldn't be able to watch it alone. Yeah. It's the scariest comedy ever made. So I did. I watched a lot of TV Land as a kid. So I, I watched a lot of like uh, different strokes and like uh, good times. Mm-hmm. And then I think when I was like seven or eight years old, I called something dynamite to one of my uncles, and they were like, "What the fuck are you?" Because you said dynamite, like Jimmy J J Walker. Yeah, well, of course you should say dynamite. I think I should bring that back. I think <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> I think that what I should do is just watch Good Times again. Just yeah. say everything that they're saying. I think I should start calling stuff jive. That's yeah, I think you I'd, could I'd, do that. I'd yeah. do that right now, but with YouTube. You call YouTube videos drive? I, no, I say I s- watch YouTube. And I say everything they say. Yeah, I do kind of do that. Yeah, yeah. I've had to stop. You know, it's so easy to pick up on just funny words from like really stupid people. And yeah, yeah. fact Who's not fiction. Playboy. What's that from? Dan Quinn. Oh yeah, yeah. I was watching. That's a, that's definitely in the upper half of words that you can take from Dan Quinn for mm-hmm. sure. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> there's some things that you don't want to take there's from one Dan about Quinn. a guy in the NFL. Yeah, no, that's yeah. a bad idea to it's take him. We I was stuff. at dinner with Alex and Joe last night, and I was uh, Alex okay. said Alex quoted it. This guy's going on a double date. Mm-hmm. Name dropper. Ooh. Alex <laughs> <laughs> Alex quoted it to me. And Joe asked me uh, why I was laughing and what it was from, and then I just showed him that full the Kim dot com video uh-huh. while the waiter was like pouring water. <laughs> Dude, it's always the worst when you go out to a wait to a, a, a waiter, restaurant, yeah. a waiter, waiter zone. Waiter, the waiter can hear everything. Yeah. yeah, you know, and you're like, oh man, mm-hmm. I wanted to talk about porn. I wanted to be silly yeah. and talk yeah. about poop, silly things. Uh-huh. I was at I was at the gym a couple days ago and I was watching Fox News on TV. Found that um, the Fox News with the sound off, and I don't know if you guys saw anything with this. I have no idea what actually the story is, mm-hmm. but Fox. I just want to do a quick kudos and a shout out to Fox News because they <laughs> landed. They landed. I think literally the story that they would couldn't have dreamed of in a yeah. million really? years. The An best, the story. most Fox News story I've ever seen. I feel well, r- I'm, I'm getting really excited. Go I'm ahead just, and tell I know. Me. I'm, I'm just want to give it a shout out. They, I looked up at the TV when I was running on the treadmill, uh-huh. and the the headline that they had it said, "Prosecutor suspended from court case no. after misgendering." child molester wow <laughs> isn't that incredible wow that I is mean, that incredible hate the player but you got to respect but the hustle <laughs> that is <laughs> pretty incredible that they, that, they, that, they, that they landed that one. Oh my god that, that is, is the, amazing, in a man. truly literally they couldn't have dreamed right. of getting that it's so funny they the prosecutor was suspended <laughs> they were prosecuting a child molester <laughs> and, and they they <laughs> suspended him from the case they could they like <laughs> If you, were, if you were, if you were like yeah. the, the writer, like the, if you're like like pitching the stories to Fox News, and they and you told them that 
they would just they would be like, no, we that that's not believe that wouldn't fucking work. And that is like, yeah, no, that look, is like I have the proof. That's Facebook comment fodder for like twenty years. Oh yeah, my that god, is, that's yeah. another. Cra- that is the biggest W that's they've ever got. My yeah. uncles are gonna have a fucking aneurysm over that. Yeah, that is fucking. That is it pretty is so crazy. <laughs> I I've been uh when I when we've been on the road I've been just uh, hotels always the only. News bragging, thing they I'm have talking about hotels. The only news thing they have is Thinks Fox. He's Drake. <laughs> I don't think I'm Drake. You think you're Drake? You think you're Drake? Look at how you're dressed. in Providence. Look, look, look at how you're dressed right now. You think you're Drake? Do you think I'm dressed like Drake, Drake in any uh-huh. way? He's Drake. Why are you making that face? It's kind of like as a the was What does he sound like? Was a 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 bear. I uh, I went to uh, uh, anytime I'm in a hotel, I just end up watching Tucker. Mm-hmm. And Tucker had the best news story I've ever seen in my life the other night. His news story was, of course liberals want to wear masks. They're not very good looking. <laughs> 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 and I was like, okay, that is the most incredible thing I've ever seen. That yeah. is the funniest thing. They and that's, yeah. that's by the way, that's on a channel. It's called The News. Yeah. <laughs> and he's just <laughs> like, liberal women are so ugly they have to wear masks. That is so fucking They've funny, been bro. On one. They've been yeah. firing on all sides. Dude, what's have you seen what's going he's on with s- Hannity? No, it, I mean what is he just he's, slam he's poon like, as always? No, he's he's literally like like trying to look like Trump. It's so funny. He's always had a No, bit he's of a, like getting like he's stopped dyeing his hair. Mm-hmm. He's getting like com- like Trump orange. Did uh wow. he's like putting on like Trump tanner just to like Look more like him so that like he, he thinks that like that that's the thing. Jubio just googled Sean Hannity today, and I do the same thing. But it's so funny to Google a celebrity's name and then today. today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here he is today, dude. He looked that's like he Stephen Colbert like. back then. Everybody oh did. Oh my god, that must be why the rapport was so was believable. so fucking satirical. I have yeah. a I have a picture of it. I, it say, I was gonna make it my phone background. Is it I love Hannity that photo or so Bill much. O'Reilly? Where where old Killa Cam went on and said you you mad, mad Bill O'Reilly? Bill but, O'Reilly. Okay. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that looks very. Oh yeah. Uh, he looks just like Trump. Yeah. He does. Um, you get a punch in on that real r- right. Quick. I don't think he needs. To, I think that's people believe you. People believe that that's Trump. It really just looks just like him. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's pretty but yeah, incredible. Fox News. Uh, it's it's cool that they are. Uh, the th- nobody seems to really care anymore. But yeah. for a while, people were so mad about Fox News. You, but I think eventually they, of, they they're pretty incredible. I I now I'm, really watch, I'm watching stuff. them pretty much every day now. Yeah, and they are r- consistently on there. It's always they always got China and Russia are teaming up. Yeah. Co- oh, they're today. COVID was leaked from a lab. They said that it's, uh, it's official. Okay, okay. That that's nice. true. Amazing. Well, they there, there often goes our talk about. They often <laughs> talk about families being murdered. Yeah. yeah, and they really are always just. Oh, they're it's hitting the, it. Yeah, they're hitting every single mark. But uh, do you remember Tommy Laren? Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. I just Who the fuck? Not a damn soul is talking about thought, her anymore. She was like a name, huge threat for a while. I thought her name lives. was yeah. Tommy Loren. I think it is probably Tommy Laren. But she's going by Tommy, Tommy Laren, so that doesn't sound like Tommy gay Loren. And French, you know. I always thought it was Tommy Loren too. She, you know, now that she, it's all over, bro. She was kind of busted. <laughs> <laughs> she was everybody. Everybody was oh, like, yeah. "Oh, it's so dangerous because she's like, if if like, well, here, uh, yeah, a hot like a conservative guy was in a hot lady's body, it's like I don't know about. A I hot well, lady. how would I, I? What I would do is I I look at her and I I just see her and I'm like, damn, she's kind of hot. And then I'm like, engage ideology glasses. Yep, that's <laughs> right. Go, Ew. That's right. Disgusting. Yeah. She got fired. I was looking it up. She got fired from the Blaze, which is like that. Like uh, what I think the. What the Daily Wire? Or no, whatever that's the fuck uh, that's Glenn. Oh yeah, Glenn Beck. Glenn, Glenn Beck's thing. thing. Yeah. He got fired from Glenn Beck's thing for being pro-life wow. or pro-choice. Yeah, pro- she, oh, because she was pro-choice? a slut. <laughs> Wait, she was in. She was pro-choice. <laughs> yeah, she said Maybe. like she said like yeah like women should Maybe have she's abortions. Not so bad. Yeah. Whoa. The idea. That's why. That's why. Turn uh, it down. Turn it down. <laughs> Trevor Noah was going on friggin' dates with her. Was he beating her up? That's what I remember. He's beating those oh cheeks, my God. dude. Trevor Noah. Kind of, Imagine them kind of creating legendary. the craziest TV Trevor show Noah's of all time. Trevor Noah's kind of legendary. He's kind of legendary for that. Kind of legendary status. He dated Dua Lipa too. Did he? Yeah, remember that, dude. He's d- he fucked Tommy Loren and Dua Lipa. Mm-hmm. Wow, wow, that's pretty incredible. <laughs> he's not funny. But yeah, whoa, <laughs> whoa, hold on, man. 
<laughs> oh, not no. funny, but hey, listen, if you're you, if man. you're watching this, or if anybody who's a part of the Hollywood celebrity group is watching this, uh, and all that Fox we, News stuff, we are not. We like him. It's an ironic Fox thing. News it's is. An, <laughs> it's an ironic thing. Fox News is not very not good. Iron, we not, like, like the not the country. Uh, it's the ironic. The, we like the. <laughs> What's that? Is that we a like thing? Uh, we like. Um, uh, Sam Cedar. Explosion. What is it? Ex- song Exploder. <laughs> <laughs> no, we like uh, we like cyanide and happiness. <laughs> yeah. that's, uh, that's where we get yeah. our stuff. XKCD. Ex- yeah. That's uh-huh. our stuff. Yeah. That's where we get all our news from. Yeah. Not Fox News. No, no, we don't read. We yeah. never we're, seen. Fox we're saying news. when we when we say Fox News fucking rocks. Yeah, we're saying and it also with a bit of a, a doomer ironic. We twin. also yeah. do not. We don't look. We don't. Like Western centric news, uh-huh. so we usually we do People's Daily China news from Africa, uh-huh. yeah. Al Jazeera, um, Al Jazeera, this type of stuff. We know we don't watch That's any guy, news that comes from over there's here. There's a guy in my street I talk to, Al Jazeera, Al Jazeera, cool. Gives you a bunch uh-huh. of news, and he told me COVID was created in a lab. Yeah. Well, they apparently it's official now. And he said that there's why a prosecutor. People, why do people care? Why were why were people so hesitant to be like, no, it wasn't created in a lab? It's like who cares? Yeah, it probably. It, I don't if, give a if fuck. That, if that it's was way scarier in a lab. If, if it actually came from a bat. That's yeah. way scarier. Oh yeah, yeah. If it came from what, that's was, true. what was that? The people were like, oh, people were eating bat soup and stuff. Yeah, but that just also looks kind of delicious. Yeah, that, that looks would, like a, one of those one, the bat soup thing. That's yeah. like a once a year you know meal. What? Actually, yeah. that's that is. That is maybe the scariest thing in the world that you could be like, I'm going to eat this. Th- I'm going to, okay, I'm. they have a crazy thing on the menu. I'm yeah. going to try it. I'm going to do it one time. I'm going to have and bad it could soup. Ruin what you, the how world. bad can it be? <laughs> <laughs> and you kill millions of people. <laughs> that's, that's literally what you say. You say out loud, bad soup? How bad can yeah. it be? <laughs> yeah, no, that that's, is. Yeah, that's, me go, me, yeah going, to the, going to like a restaurant where they're like, yeah, we serve a kangaroo burger. And you're like, yeah. oh, <laughs> interesting. And then, yeah, a year Five later. Five million, a million people, people yeah. are dead. I've never had bison before, <laughs> yeah. right? It's like that. It's just an animal. It's not that crazy to eat a bat. Uh, and I know this restaurant uh, is taking the 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 appropriate safety precautions. They're not yeah. like just throwing God, that all is the. So, I never they're not really throwing all the that in a, a tub. If, if, yeah, that is that, that is way <laughs> more terrifying. That's also like that's a story like nobody could ever believe like that. Eating, yeah. eating of the, course, yeah, that's yeah, not eating what the happened. Domino's pizza out of your fridge after six days and being like, I really shouldn't, but like I'm <laughs> yeah. really hungry. Just destroy the world. Just literally. Just They're fucking it Molotov cocktails yeah. being thrown yeah. into <laughs> windows, right? <laughs> families just being like, e- like just xing out <laughs> members of families on the Christmas yeah, you- cards. Because <laughs> 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 you were like, you're like, do pepperonis go bad? <laughs> Wait, I don't think so, yeah, right? You skin <laughs> like a ghoul. <laughs> you <have> like. <laughs> <laughs> like half the people that you know in your life now have just like no stomach. Oh my god! Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That, of course it was just some guy in a lab who was like, "Oh uh, uh, shit, I spilled this." Yeah, yeah just doing yeah. Powerpuff Girls and just mixing up the ratio. Yeah, I just forgot to change clothes before he went home. Yeah, yeah. exactly. That's yeah. It. yeah, yeah. There's no. I mean. What it wasn't bats though. Then people were like, "No, it's pangolins," and I was like, "Okay, new animal to know about." Pangolins yeah. are the ones with the big claws. Yeah, they're like it they looks, have scales. Yeah. They're they are like one of the coolest looking. It's an aardvark. Yeah, cool. Animal. It's not an aardvark. You're thinking it's more close, of an armadillo. It's, cr- it's like an armadillo or aardvark kind yeah. of. Yeah, but it's it's, it's an armadillo different. aardvark. That was one. That was an animal. He just said that aardvark. I did. That's like my little brother used to only he called it an avocado. Couldn't <laughs> say V's. Weirdest fucking. Uh, Speech impediment I've ever seen. What is a pangolin? These animals are sometimes named the scaly anteater. Okay, I don't like. Th- it says yeah, another another notable. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought it said noble ant eating mammal. That'd I don't be like noble. I don't like in, do- in, in uh, documentaries where they I call an animal noble. I call every I like animal it. noble. I don't like that. I love it. What is uh, what is the animal that's doing funny. that's impressive at all? Look at that thing. They're this cool. thing probably eats its own shit, man. If that if that's what fucking COVID came from. Then it isn't beat it us. crazy that just diseases in general they just come from animals. Yeah, and then they just make that leap. That's yeah. pretty scary. That's what I'm That's pretty. Just, yeah, I I've been recently very very afraid of mad cow disease. Yeah, mm. mad cow disease is, is, disease is scary because it just pops up for no reason in 250 yeah. people a year, and you have one month to live. Yeah, scary. one month to live. And here's the here's the thing. Here's the symptoms. No cure for it. Here's no cure. Here's the symptoms. Now you get me feeling scared. crazy. <laughs> headaches. Check. Yeah. I get headaches. And losing your memory. 
check. Oh, shit. I forget shit all the time. Yeah. Bro. I get kind of worried about uh, maybe I'll accidentally eat human flesh and get like a prion disease or something. Yeah. Pre- yeah, the prion thing. Kuru or something. Yeah. So prion, mad cow is is prion. Yeah. I yeah. still don't really know what prions are. I it's said that I said it brain. to somebody last night and they were like, is that Scientology? I was like, no, but I That's get how you could think that. Yeah, it does sound like a fake thing. Yeah, but it's like something no, it's, that it's if you a, get too much in your brain, brains, it's in brains too. I think. Oh, okay. Like yeah. if you eat, that's what you get prion disease. If you, I think. But if Maybe you get not. too many, prions, well, I think you can get prion disease from eating brain too. At least is what I'm. That's P R I Y O N. P R I O N. Damn. Like what am I thinking of? Wait, say it again. P R I Y O N N E S. That's a name. Prionis. 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 Yeah. Or like princess. What am I, what am I thinking of? All right, I guys. Don't know what you're I completely of. forgot that we have an amazing. Oh, speaking of disgusting. a bunch of eating. <laughs> yeah. Speaking of eating stuff until That's you turn true. into a crazy. You're, that thing. was a good segue. Uh-huh. That you got was it good. Today. C- good job. Whoa. Wow. I'm pretty impressed. You're that might be up. your first one ever. That's the first time I've ever done a good segue. That was pretty good. He's too much headroom in that shot. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. All right. <laughs> That's Let's get into it. Time. Today we're uh-huh. doing a website. Should I say the name of the website? Uh, no. It looks like, uh, yeah. It'll be in the. It'll be in I the the slides. It's a website where there's a feeding f- a feeders forum for uh-huh. people yeah, it's who for people who like to eat sexually mm, yeah. and be like, fat sexually. Yeah, you may think that you like eating, but I promise you don't <laughs> like it as much as these people. And if you do, you should not watch this episode at work because you might get a bonger. Yeah. Yep. Also, yeah, we should. I was thinking, should we put a content warning on this episode or something? Be like, yeah, hey, we probably should. Do you hate <laughs> disgusting food? Eating? My stuff ain't that. Isn't that? I maybe have a few that's pr- that are kind of I mean, it's, really ba- it's nasty, not as nasty as diapers. No, so no, it's that. definitely not as bad as. It's diapers. not as bad as diaper talk. If we combined the two, that could be. I don't like bad. that. Which yeah. I think there is a bit of an overlap. I'm gonna yeah, know. Uh-huh. yeah. So to get into this website, and this is yeah, it's like a forum, but it's it's kind of like a forum. Oh, and also I want a shout out to uh, um, a, a Twitter user at neurotard who showed who sent this website to me okay. thank you for this this is all I for you don't um, agree with your username i think that is not um okay to say what's wrong with it but Why? uh thank you for <laughs> that's his name <laughs> yeah what well, that's that's his name <laughs> thank you for sending us that website um, um but what's his name i think his name it's like Jack. but it's it's like a, it's a forum but it's all it's mo it's more like a social media feed than a forum. Uh-huh. Yeah, which I feed didn't know and feed is the operative word it's here. It's basically a yeah. Facebook clone for people who want to get as fat it's as humanly <laughs> possible. Yeah, that's crazy. Which well, you might you might hear that and say, wait, you mean Facebook? Oh shit! Come on. That took. We have to make eye contact when you cheers, or yeah. it's bad luck. Let's Absolutely. dive in. All right, let's dive in here. Um, also, I'm still getting into uh, themes on PowerPoint. I think they're. I think you guys should look them up. I really like. Wait, okay. So tell me about these themes, man. Because these themes. I looked up food theme. Wow. Continue. And look at that. Look at that. Comes with a preset background of this what I think is Korean barbecue or in, something. This is basically Incredibad. Mm-hmm. That is to say, funny uh, and original. <laughs> so first thing, uh, first thing. Well, you guys, I, I'm guessing that you guys used your computers to do this. To look this up. No, yes. I did it in my brain. You did it in your brain. <laughs> <laughs> I did uh, it on a on an app. I just imagined everything. <laughs> no, well, I'm just saying. Uh, I use the mobile app okay. that they have. The proprietary well, they have mobile, a mobile app, app on Groico. Oh, and Groki- Grokio. Grokio um, asked um, as soon as I downloaded it. It asked me to track my activity across other companies' apps and websites. And you pressed allow. And, and allow. obviously, I pressed allow. They also asked for my location. <laughs> okay. So that uh, they could get my approximate location. You do have to put your location. Yeah, in. you do. Uh-huh. Yeah, which is kind of yeah. Weird. I had to use this while I, I had to look this up. I had to prepare for this episode while I was moving my apartment. So I had to use the app the whole time, and it tracked me the entire time. So I was nice. jumping all over the fucking place. It thought that you were going just kitchen to kitchen, just uh-huh. fucking yeah. slapping oh, yeah. down croissants. Yeah, so this first thing here is the first post that I saw. Oh, this is my, this is my account. Okay. It's feed me fo- at Feed Me Very, food very funny. <laughs> and okay. this is my profile picture. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. I bet. Um, but you got a lot of messages. Yeah, I have a hey, feeling. Hey, I had a feeling that we were all going to have a pretty similar idea today. <laughs> yeah, I didn't make my profile. <laughs> no, you didn't make your no, profile? I I figured that someone else was going to do this. Oh, uh, yeah. like fat. 
All right. Well, I made my first post. Feel so fat after deluxe cheeseburgers. <laughs> Wait. So on your app, it says like and comment. Yeah. Because that's not how it is on the computer. Oh, yeah. no, I can't it's wait. Way, it's I way can't better. wait to see what it's called when we when we dive into your guys' stuff. Mine says because like and comment. Really? Yeah. What does wow. yours say? I guess we'll see. Right, we'll that's, see wait, what do you mean? What? Mine Why said like it? and comment. I think. Are we on a different website? Maybe. On Grommer? Yeah. Mine said well, like and comment. All right. Well, well yeah. We'll get here's to feed it. me food more. Feel so fat after deluxe cheeseburgers. These are the kind of posts that you see. Pounds of cake. This is not directly referencing anyone, but some of y'all need therapy. Damn. <laughs> That's cold. A lot of infighting, and I'm worried that they're talking about me. Mm-hmm. Probably. Yeah. It oh, well. It surprise me. Uh, every time my fat belly breaks something, it brings me great delight. <laughs> Today I broke a ladder instantly <laughs> when I stepped on it. Instantly. That's what I've noticed. Yeah, there's so many... Some a lot of people on here, their specific fetish about being fat is breaking stuff. Yeah. Who, which is cool because it's just ultimately a power fantasy. Yeah, yeah. But also, like, what is that guy doing where he needs to get on a ladder? Painting. Oh yeah, I guess <laughs> get the paintings. cookie jar off the top of the True, fridge. That's what it is. Get to the top of the fridge where you have the dog treats yeah. and you've run out of food in your house. I like this post. <laughs> it's just like just just. This boils the whole website down to its yeah. essentials. Yeah. Big fat belly eaten again. Bear Cub ninety four. Uh-huh. Hey, he's not that old for a no. belly that big. No. Oh Three no. Three more years I could have a belly yeah. like that. Yeah. That's what I'm learning. Uh finding size. Fucking Girl Scouts are gonna <laughs> clean me out. I just tried the Adventure Fools or whatever they are, and I'm already going to go for another box and some Thin Mints. Probably going to get some Tagalongs, too, and those s'more ones. Fuck, I'm going to buy a ton. <laughs> Dude, if you buy Girl Scout cookies and you eat them, something's wrong with you, man. You eat, you eat, you? You eat one and you give them to uh, somebody else. What? If you eat a whole box of Girl Scout cookies, I'm just anti. I've, been, I've become very anti-sweets and cookies this year. I don't want You've cookies. You've completely lost the plot. You think I've lost the plot, mate? You've You're completely acting lost the plot. You're acting You're com- a bit well, You were daft. daft. Yeah. I only eat butter and meat. <laughs> you have All a tapeworm in you that is probably eaten so good. You want a little? Yeah, you want a little one I in don't, you? <laughs> I don't want your tapeworm in Whatever, me. bitch. I don't want your tapeworm you in You want me. it? Ah. The amount of C4 energy that that tapeworm... As a creatine, that What's tapeworm, this? that is probably the no, it's, it's super creatine. Swimming in circles you around in there. <laughs> have bang energy in that or something. I don't believe that there's actual coffee in there. I switched to coffee. I've realized recently that caffeine is the most fucked up extreme drug. Yeah. And it'll make you really scared of your own house. Yeah, so me too. Continue. <laughs> yeah, it's well. pretty scary. Puts a small mouse and crushes it in one hand in front of you. <laughs> Are you afraid? Do you have fear in your life? Eats the mouse. That happened, and there's nothing you can do about Whoa. it. Shoves you. Oh, my what, God. Who the f- what kind <laughs> of sick fuck would like this? The one blob. person likes this. This is a post from The Blob. Pulls out a small mouse and crushes that is it in one hand. This guy needs a... This is not what this website's for. No, this no. is not what this website this is for. This guy got the wrong idea. I've also... Uh, Made, uh, made sure that I didn't uh, make anyone's names public. Or yeah, anything. that was smart, especially for that yeah. one. I will say this guy should have been. When I was looking for, I was trying to find this this website because I forgot the name, and uh, I was just like searching thing, and I found a website that was called like the Sociopath Forum. <laughs> and I'd like to explore that. Yeah, we gotta time. look through that. We'll, one. Get, yeah. we'll get to that for uh, sure. This next one here, Bear Belly Twenty Four. <laughs> fun fact: My belly button is over an inch deep. <laughs> Imagining him sticking a that a, should be on a Jeopardy. Tape measure into it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alex Trebek. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is an inch deep. This uh, what, what is Beer Belly Twenty yeah, Four's Bear Belly Twenty Four's uh, belly button. button? Oh, I'm sorry. It's not Beer Belly. It's Bear Belly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'd love to see one of those YouTube videos where it's like GoPro lowered into hole. Yeah, into belly <laughs> button. <laughs> it's, belly button. <laughs> it's two seconds yeah. long, but still really, it's grosser. This g- this guy I really Whoa. like. Whoa. The big fat greedy boss. This is somebody who's like doing uh, cosplay stuff, I guess, on here. Is, uh, that's his kind of like character. The big fat greedy boss. That's good. It, it's time. It's times like this you all have to suffer, my boy. Takes a bite of hoagie. You'll see when revenue is down, we have. You didn't munch. You need to say that. Uh, we all have to do with less. I'm afraid there are just isn't enough to go around. Wow, the big fat greedy boss. That's what he sounds like. 
Kind of a kind of Rick vibes. Yeah, kind getting of Rick, Rick vibes from that. Rick the series Sanchez vibes, vibes from yeah. him. For this show, next show. one here. My new catchphrase. This is from Hungry. <laughs> <laughs> this guy does look hungry. Imagine He's pretty skinny. Getting, imagine getting that username on this website. I know. Yeah, oh, that's man. pretty amazing. Yeah. You probably have to pay like five hundred dollars oh, yeah, yeah. to buy it from someone. <laughs> Buying it from somebody who's been I'm, sitting yeah, I'm on gonna it. buy up every I'm gonna make a hundred accounts on here called like ice cream eater, burger <laughs> lover, yeah, <laughs> and ransom them off to people. <laughs> Making an account called hamburger and just being yeah. like, I hope somebody You know what <laughs> this the bio being like you can buy this can be your username for Ten thousand yeah. dollars. Metabolism yeah. at metabolism. Uh, oh yes, God. I'm gonna eat a tub of ice cream, but not sure if it's due down to boredom or horniness or both. Do you think these people just have a wire crossed in their head that confuses hunger in their penis? Maybe. You know what it is? What? And I'll have I have a whole section on this in my slides. Okay. But I think literally I think seventy five percent of them got got this way from watching Willy Wonka. Yeah, no, no, no. We, we've talked that. about this. Yeah, before. I would believe that. No, but that. this I have empirical you proof. Have proof? Oh, okay, yeah, proof. Okay, we'll get to that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this next person here. Oh, what's this one? What did it? Okay. Future Chub. Any feeder wants to force tons of food and gallons <laughs> of soda in my gut, swelling it to dangerous state and shape, and making me almost to pop. Oh. Feeling of total overfeeding and tons of pain on my gut will make me pre cum on it like it's a broken water hose. Oh, <laughs> oh god. my god! <laughs> the descriptions that they have on this website are are pretty fucking crazy. And I don't remember if it's the next slide where somebody. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> that's this one. Uh, I love to be blackmailed to get fat. Trying to eat food for like four or five people delivered to me and having to record all my eating to not publish my kinks. And <laughs> same, oh, but I doubt it could happen to hot jocks. Feed me food mm. more commented. Oh, interesting. Oh, they said, oh. I well, you that. that's you. That's you. It's your account. You said you made that account. That is you. I, did, I thought maybe I cropped the screenshot. <laughs> no. No, you did not. Hmm. Uh, this next one. <laughs> oh, my God. Little Susie fell down the well. Do something. Cracks a glow stick and throws it down the well. Thwack. Ow. She's alive. You know what? That's Somebody it. is I on here it. doing weird Twitter style line break jokes. Could have been. Uh, <laughs> could have eaten her. Could have been worse. Could have been a lot worse. Could have been a lot worse. He could have eaten her. <laughs> this one's really good. <laughs> This is just a screenshot of yeah, YouTube.com. I didn't really, so I didn't really have time to organize all my all my slides, but I just wanted to show that this person just linked to YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> kind of an amazing post. It's uh-huh. a good post. Oh yeah, but this is the same person. These are I think all these next slides are from the same person who's who's uh trying their hand at these like line break style jokes here. Uh, okay. gives you a comically oversized question mark to give to a friend when they say something that makes you go, What the fuck are you talking about? And no, you can't use it on me. Damn, I would like to gift you a comically oversized question hey, mark. I, that with the way use. my brain works, I know I'd be getting that thing a lot. Yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. I've for sure, for sure. Mm-hmm. My new catchphrase. Uh, this next That's one cool. here. Takes an overdose <laughs> level of laxatives and stands in the <laughs> elevator for 12 hours with an unending, unresponsive smile. Evil smile. You miss evil, evil smile. It's the most important that word in the, the whole fucking book. It's like that evil movie smile. Devil with the. Yeah. That <laughs> is. <laughs> yeah, but he just starts yeah. shitting. Yeah, just, just a fountain of egg. dookie. Yeah. Damn. Oh, wow. Because it smells straight up like sulfur in uh-huh. there. Wow. Next one here. Same guy. Pizza slices are legally considered the Italian ninja star. I defy you to challenge me. Mm. Oh, I eat of the food. Oh, I become uh, the 700 pounds and come on a guy's chest. <laughs> that would be a pretty funny account on here. I have to Fat admit Fat Italian it. Elon Musk. Yeah, that would be some That would shit. be fucking dope, dude. That would be fucking amazeballs. I think maybe after this, we change all of our, or we change one of our accounts into that. No, uh, that's the next same guy. <laughs> Me is a mafia boss. Kind of in the same like straight like uh yeah. like line well, that of makes sense here. they like mafia bosses. Starts punching the table very passionately. I want him dead! I want his family buried! I want his house plants dead! I want his house burned to the ground! I want to spit on the ashes! Can you oh. read? You said buried and it says dead. Yeah. You really can't read at no, all. No, I can't read from here. I don't have my glasses. I wasn't going to say anything, but you've done that for every one of them so yeah. far. Yeah, what's going on with you today? You okay? No, I... You've been I misreading everything. Literally stepped on my glasses while I was moving. Nerd. Yeah. Velma status. Me, if you ever Jesus pass Christ. away in front of me, I promise I'll bury you in your native land of China. Other guy. Wait, what? Me. Shh, shh. Closes their eyes with two fingers. These aren't even about feeding, bro. Why did you even put these in here? 
Because I wanted to show you that, that the users of this website are actually fucking comedy gods. Oh, okay. What's what would you say the joke is there? Oh uh, well, here's okay. Now, now, now we're back, back into the good stuff. This Girl like. Scout cookies are here. America, don't be fat. Also, don't miss our national bake sale. Oh, sound. a political another joke. Another joke. Political joke. Yeah, they are pretty mm-hmm. smart. And then this, uh, I think this is the last slide here. I don't usually post so frequently, i.e., twice within five to six hours. But this is a required required post. Finally, someone is pointing it out. Some 23% of Fortune 500 com- por- corporations Whoa. claim to engage with the Sustainable Development Goals framework. Yet, a peer-reviewed study found that a measly 0.2% have developed concrete methods and tools to evaluate their prog- progress toward relevant SDGs. Is that S- is an S or a 5? That's an S. Okay. Only 29% <laughs> of almost 12,000 Fortune 500, w- Fortune 100 board directors had relevant ESG credentials, according... Look, I'm not going to read the whole thing, but somebody <laughs> somebody went on here to get on their damn soapbox. You can't read. I, <laughs> no, I can't, can't read, read without my glasses. The TV's too far away. The gla- <laughs> too far away. <laughs> I'm nearsighted. I can't fucking see that shit. I can't believe I'm learning today that my friend can't read a lick of English. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Well, good job, Pat. Mm-hmm. We'll go over to my slides. It's very interesting that, uh, well, I get to this. Okay, so okay, so, you went so, on I, Phoebe. so listen, so I tried to, to sign up for Grommer, mm-hmm. right? But uh, I did, for whatever reason, I didn't get my the verification code. You have to do like a text and an email verification. Yeah. And my verification code wouldn't come through. It kept getting stuck in a Damn. spam filter or something. So I just tried their uh, kind of sister site, which is called Phoebe, which I guess I found out that Grommer is, is mostly for gay feeding. Oh, uh-huh. and Phoebe yeah. is basically the straight version. Okay, oh. it's a social networking community for feeders, feedies, fat admirers. We're a quirky bunch of men and women who love words like curvy. Uh, it was designed with the needs of heterosexual feederism community in mind, though we remain open to all people of all orientations. So I went in okay. there. I got in there and I made an account. <laughs> uh, Patrick Doran, <laughs> NYC. <laughs> we did the same fucking thing. <laughs> well, but I said your name and location. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, I, I gave them, I was stupid. I gave them my location. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I gave them app tracking. I did uh, Patrick Door in NYC, <laughs> and I made some. <laughs> uh, I joined and said, What are some good foods to get started with? Henry Co. I already liked it. You didn't even post a photo of me? Uh, I thought that that would be a little much, you yeah. know? Yeah. Damn. And also, I didn't have any photos of you on my phone, as surprising as that sounds. Wow. Yeah, not a single you, that's, one. That's fucked Because I'm a fucked fake up. ass friend. That's you really are fake. Up. I have so many photos of you. So, Phoebe was eating. kind of a little bit different than uh, the Grommer stuff. The right? interface looks exactly the same. Yeah. Yeah, but some of the, the, the it user looks like they base. Might have, they might have different. taken the exact same site template. Well, they must it have is, Googled it's also a website template. No, it's also Grokio. It's the same company. Oh, okay. Runs okay. Yeah. So, you probably had it on that app as well. Yeah. Uh, this is fat, <laughs> fat to- 420 queen says, I'm a pig and fat man walking says, message me. Oh, it's also liked by the fat gentleman and, and make this me is, game. all of the, the, you just pay attention to the people who like these posts. They are incredible. Some incredible names yeah. on there. Uh, fat 420 pig. This is all of her, all basically all of her posts here. I want to eat food. Who want to rub my belly while I eat time to eat. And these were all like on the same day. Uh-huh. Pretty amazing. Make her bigger is a really good name. <laughs> <laughs> Chubby nerd. Yeah, big fatty bear coda. Um, what else? Uh, fat future. <laughs> Does anyone just want to trap me in their house and turn me into their very own fat toy? I promise I'm very easy to capture. Fat future. And there was a couple fat of comments future there. Food gang, eat them all. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, there was a comment there, but it got cropped out. It looked like um, <laughs> yeah. somebody, I can't really read it. But yeah, I can't read it either. Yeah, somebody but it says w- something about me. Yeah. Uh, okay. I don't yeah. know who commented that. Yeah, who knows? Um, she likes her belly. Is one foodie of the ones. Fairy. She likes her belly. <laughs> this is from Foodie Fairy. So, I woke up to two baked potatoes sitting on the oven. Everybody appears to be asleep. I want to eat them so bad. Should I? People are saying, do it, yes, put all the toppings. But then Mormon Tempest says, yes, but I'm sure there's more context <laughs> to consider. <laughs> we have to look at both sides yeah. of this. Yeah, come on I'm now. pretty certain there's more to this story. Uh, all right, what else? Yeah, you have a gas leak in your house, and you forget that you've been making yourself baked potatoes every <laughs> night. <laughs> this is, uh, I've been, then I started looking at some of the profiles, so I found uh-huh. this guy. This is Fatty Fatty. 
right? 21 Egg years old. Corpus. Six feet tall, 366 pounds. This yeah. is a big, big guy. The best, I didn't put any of these screenshots in my slides, but the best part of this is that if you go to someone's profile, it shows you exactly how much they, how tall they are and how yeah. much they weigh. And there's and some incredible combinations. It, uh, you can only check two per day, so I didn't get a screenshot, but you can check people's weight history. In a oh, chart, yeah. which is well, on I also didn't put this in, but in, on Grammar, if you scroll through people's feeds, it posts updates like a Facebook feed where it says like it says like this guy gained five pounds today, and yeah. everyone comments is like nice, yeah. getting close to four hundred. Yeah, it does the same thing here. But I found this guy fatty, fatty, and I really liked him, so I sent him a flirt on the actions <laughs> uh, as Patrick Dorn NYC. I said uh, I'd love to have dinner number three with you. <laughs> Oh, you select the flirt. Yeah, so you can do belly rubs, hugs. Yeah. Hi, how's it going? Great profile. Thanks for following. Eat up. I'd love a belly rub from you. You're handsome. You're gorgeous. Nice curves. If bigger is better, you must be incredible. You're a chubby goddess. You're my WCW. You're my MCM. Let's go Weight Watchers and piss people off. Let's go to Weight Watchers and piss people off. And you look like someone who enjoys long walks to the buffet, <laughs> <laughs> which is kind of a good yo mama joke. Yeah, yeah. that is good. Uh he uh, he posts stuff like, this. I'm really sad now. I gave $50 to someone who scammed me. If I gave you $50, would you run to or would you buy food? Uh, liked by you and Carmen as a whole. Liked by Patrick Dorn, NYC, I guess. Um, taking blob applications. <laughs> <laughs> blob applications. Blob applications. Uh, I have an idea, and if any feedy wants to do it, shoot me a message. You go to the drive-thru, and I give you about 50 to $75. You go up and order one large meal. After you finish it, you order another large meal, etc., until you can't fit another ounce inside your belly. Plus, everyone working there will definitely think you're a huge fatty. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then this guy had an amazing name. Opiate of the Massive. Wow. Oh, Tell me that, that is, is not a sick. fucking sick That is man. incredible. He's been on here for six years. Let's take a look at some of his posts. He's in Philly. Uh, let's explore the dying malls and take notes on the empty temples of a dying consumerist god together. Oh, like by Topanga. This guy is sick, dude. That is sick. That's crazy. This guy's fucking ill. I really like his post. I'm sure he's also pretty ill if he's on this yeah, website. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Another 2023 resolution. He has some some feelings about the community. Okay. Being more forthcoming about liking someone and wanting to make out with them and make them unrecognizably <laughs> fat, among other things, edited. <laughs> uh, and then he also says, I don't care if you're trying to hit on a guy, a gal, or a non-binary pal. Don't let your very first fucking message to a complete stranger be a compliment about their anatomy and your desire to touch it. And Bay says, or about a belly button survey. <laughs> 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 That's what most of my first messages to people are like. Oh, yeah, would you survey like about to your belly button? Be in a belly button I, survey. I, I'm from the the. Uh, I'm from the U.S. Census. <laughs> yeah, the I'm US doing census. a belly button survey. That was the word I was looking for. Uh, <laughs> okay, the massive a says sticker has a pen that yeah. has just like, <laughs> like <laughs> sticks it in the belly button. Ah, hmm. <laughs> sniffs it. He says reserving an entire section of the buffet so it's just you and me, so no one is any the wiser about me stuffing you until you can't move and rubbing your belly to make more room until it's time to leave and I have to wheel you out. And Patrick Dorn NYC says would love that. Wow, it's kind of an interesting. <laughs> Those words there kind of it kind of sounds like. It sounds like lyrics. You could maybe turn this into a song. Yeah, you could. Uh, and then I found this guy, NYC Locale, right? So he seems pretty cool. He's in Irvington, New York. He's 22 years old, five feet tall. And he, if you notice, he doesn't seem very fat. So no. what could he be doing on this here feeder forum? Maybe he's trying to gain. Well, I or think he could that... Be a, trying to gain muscle. I think you might be surprised. Here's his first post. Uh, he's joined Phoebe. <laughs> been a minute since I've been on Phoebe. Hit me up, New York locals. Gassy women are way too underappreciated. <laughs> So let's okay. look at some of his other posts. Any gassy women want to talk? Do any women like to fart but don't have the fetish? <laughs> that one was edited. Uh, does anyone know how I can make a feedy bloated and gassy? I know the basics, but not sure what else works. Big Beautiful Belly 18 says, lots of soda. <laughs> and he says, thanks. For me, it's lots of garlic. Do any women like air inflation? I do, but I don't do it IRL. <laughs> LOL. Uh, and then so <laughs> <laughs> I finally got into Grommer. <laughs> I finally got into Grommer <laughs> and made a new account. This is Cameron Fetter. <laughs> uh, 24 years old, New York. I identify as gainer, gender other, interested in men, looking for asexual relationships, languages, uh, English and Vietnamese, in the process of rapidly gaining weight. We've been talking about this. You're rapidly putting on humongous pounds 
And I made some <laughs> friends pretty fast just by posting that photo. I got a message from NYC Encourager. Great photo, hair and shirt, Cameron. Let's meet up. Cheer. <laughs> this guy's going to be so mad. He, I cut my hair. He's going to fucking kill me. Oh, yeah. When he dude. finds out I don't have he's that gonna hair anymore. He's going to see you. What if he's, he's a take hair gainer, down? too? And I'm not even wearing that shirt. What if he's a hair you're gainer? You're endangering my life. And then I guess. No, no, no. I, no man, you're going to be fine. I missed. The I, bullets will ricochet off. You. I must have lost the <laughs> screenshot this morning because I couldn't find it. But I did find one where the guy was like. I just had it was, it was just this other account that I found, and I and uh, he had this one post that was like, uh, "Just had the most amazing experience of my life. I uh, made myself completely jizz to completion, uh, just by jiggling my belly fat in the shower." <laughs> and every comment was like, "Congratulations, congratulations, congrats." Uh, that's the best part. Is everyone? Everyone knows what's up on here you yeah know, everyone well like not that everyone knows what's up but like everybody who who posts something the only comments are always like great it's yeah. no one even asking any clarify no, no, everyone no. knows everything that's why i was pretty surprised that yeah. one person even wanted context for the potatoes thing because they weren't just blindly like yeah eat every piece of food around you like you're in an rpg they were like yeah there might be some context needed yeah, for the potatoes. yeah, yeah. Um, all right, so now I have my slides that okay. Jubio really rudely put a title slide on for no reason. This it's is literally not needed. Aggressive. I don't know he why he did that. He, he keeps, keeps doing this. He keeps adding this fucking title thing. It's pissing keeps, me off. It's, it's, it's looks It looks horrible. Look it's at the, the theme of oh, it. What, what are you going to put terrible. on here? A swastika, you fucker? Oh, uh, th oh, that's great. Yeah, thanks a Your lot. Your slides, look, you look great. All right, now stop clicking. All right, now here are mine. Um, okay. So, first of all, this is from Fatstagram. This is the first post I found. Sat next to a beer belly guy at a Berlin Nail screening. <laughs> Couldn't focus on the movie the whole time. LOL. <laughs> a Berlin Nail, I don't know if you guys know, that's like the Berlin Film Festival. <laughs> that's <laughs> like how they play. It's like a prestigious film festival. It's like festival. con? Yeah, so he was he was sitting and he was watching. He, he was seeing like a uh, uh, fucking whatever movie. What's the movie that Jubio likes? That's about, Tar? That's about Ireland. Sure, Tar. And he just he's just the entire time looking at the guy who's <laughs> next to him. Belly. Um, Coleman, 2021. <laughs> Anyone who wants to poop on me? <laughs> and what you'll notice here also, on Grommer, they're not likes. They're called noms. I didn't oh. even notice that, dude. And it says th these people nom things. Oh, wow. my God. Yeah, it says, like, fat belly guy, one, two, three, noms this. Dude, so that Phoebe. must be short for nominate. Yeah. For nominate. an award. Yeah. An award. For every every for click like, is yeah. a nomination, a nomination. For an yeah, award. True. Yeah. Um, let's see what else you have here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is where your theory kind of yeah. comes in. Yeah, is this guy says garbage can eighteen says wish I could turn into a blueberry. Yeah, <laughs> garbage can eighteen was making me laugh so hard. Garbage can, garbage can eighteen. Garbage can 18. 18. Which uh, you gotta hope he's not five years old. And that's <laughs> a, that'd be yeah. bad news if he's um, on this website. But I found yeah, I found a bunch of blue blueberry is one of the is ever I've I've so this the other thing on this website you can only do one search per day. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I've been on here for days on end. <laughs> or, unless you get the premium. <laughs> Which I did not get the it's premium. It's only nine bucks. I really thought about it. Yeah, I also I thought about it, but I was like, I yeah. can just log on to this every day for five yeah. days, and that's okay. Yeah. And the first search I did, before I realized there was a limit, the one of the top hashtags are like trending searches every day is blueberry. <laughs> <laughs> if they, people just search blueberry, they can log on here and they search blueberry <laughs> and they look at all the posts. Um Squishy Bum Boy says, I'm in such a blueberry mood. Someone turn me into a blueberry right now. Oh, my God. Uh, Wonka93 <laughs> says, the most unrealistic thing about Willy Wonka is that he isn't fat. If I were in that factory, I'd be so round. Hell, I'd probably greet my guests just permanently as a blueberry. <laughs> he just roll out as a blueberry, bro? Wonka93. Yeah, these are friends of Wonka. Fatten me to death, PA. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling like a blueberry right now. <laughs> Fatten me to death. <laughs> Obi, he's on here a bunch. I'll see a Fatten bunch of Fatten me him. to death, Fatten PA. Fatten me to death. Wow. Uh, the devil. <laughs> 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 I need a Mr. Wonka top hat to wear while an obese blueberry brat gulps me down. And then a bunch of emojis. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> the devil! The devil! <laughs> Holy fuck! The look devil! The devil picture. hops out here. He's like, I need to look like Willy Wonka. <laughs> Dude, I gotta say, you don't see any shit like this over on Phoebe, man. No, the, no, this is way better than the, Phoebe. The, the um, big bellied boy, tired. This guy doesn't really care that much. Tired and exhausted. Just want to be a balloon or blueberry or whatever. He doesn't give a fuck. fucking He's two. Just, just a balloon or a blueberry. Or All right, you know what? I want to be a blueberry, but if I it, look, if you can make me a gobstopper, yeah. that's cool. I'll take whatever. I'll I'm not too pressed uh, about schnozberry. it. Schnozberry. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be a schnozberry. Um, 
Pokemon gainer. So here, here's something that I learned. What? The amount of fat people in Houston is amazing. So many big round-bellied civilians too. So these feeders called non-feeders Whoa. civilians. That, wow. and that I so saw a sick. bunch of that. Really? Yeah. yeah. They, they call, call them civvies. C- civilians. Wow, yeah. dude. Very, very exciting. To Do you think that. they have like, like you know, and like military guys have like gear that they make? Like shirts and stuff that yeah. say like "proud infidel" or whatever. Do you know what else they have? You think that they I have didn't? Like I wasn't able to found. Yeah. Anything, yeah. I wasn't. I didn't have enough <laughs> days <laughs> to search this. <laughs> <laughs> they also have. They have a cruise. That they no all way. go on a cruise <laughs> yes! ship, dude. That is oh a dangerous, dangerous. Yeah. Cruise and people, ship. people will post <laughs> and be like, "Is the cruise any good? Should I go?" People will be like, "Yeah, you gotta go." <laughs> wow. Do they fuck? Well, that's the oh, problem. Yeah. yeah, they have to really carefully distribute their bedrooms on the cruise ship. So they just it's another a full, Titanic situation. They full the ship all the way over. This whole yeah. thing, yeah, that's yeah. amazing. Um, here's another Pokemon Gator. Tonight's Last of Us wrecked me. Wow. Yeah. So they're keeping up with mm. with, with all the big prestige TV shows. Heavy fart load. <laughs> so sorry about this one in uh, advance. All right. Wish I had a lazy farting homebody gainer buddy to spend the day baking, baking, and baking with, smoking up, and then baking our turds in our butts for <laughs> days to see who can grow the biggest toilet clogger and lay the stinkiest pre poop farts. We would also be making heavy, fattening, constipating baked goods, never leaving the house as we fart and fap our lives away at home. Oh my so, God. so eating eating a bunch <laughs> Baking our turds in our a bunch, butts. Eating a bunch so that you like it, so, well, like, it, it, it's yeah. the oven. But can I direct your attention to the most incredible part of this uh-huh. post? Yeah. Baking, baking, and baking. Yeah. They're talking about making baked goods to bake farts in their oh. bellies and then smoking weed and baking. God damn. That's bake, like, uh, it's instead of wake and bake, it's bake, bake, and bake. Oh. That's like those, like, sentences that you see on Wikipedia that's like, oh, yeah, it's all one word, but buffalo, it makes a complete... The buffalo, 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 yeah. Yeah. Baking, baking, and baking. Oh. <laughs> so, yeah. Wow. Pretty crazy, right? Um, let's keep going, though. Heavy fart load again. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Is there a world poop size championship? <laughs> I've, been ma- I've been baking a massive Grogan in my poop shoot Grogan. for over a week, and I can barely leave bed. Farting constantly as the turd festers and generates fart what? gas. Feels amazing as the farts leak out around the enormous rock-hard blockage. Anyone else have a log size fetish? He's, are, are, he has a w- Grogan's the fucking the the aliens from Mass Effect. The big I don't leg. know. I never played Mass. Wait, Effect. this oh. guy hasn't taken a shit in a week. Yeah, he's baking a Grogan. Holy fuck, man! I swear to God. Um, let's see. I think yeah. And then there's a comment on there from mm-hmm. this big stomach. Did you know there was a man that had a genetic condition which made it so that he couldn't poop at all, and he ballooned so <laughs> much? I think he was known as a human balloon. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Krogan. <laughs> Krogan. Yeah. I don't know what a Grogan is. I assume well, it's Krogan. Turd. Krogans are like I'm like careful. What now. they look they, like. They if you if start this just talking about yeah, if this if you grew a turd that looks like this. Uh, oh the way oh they're the frog guys. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, okay. That would be yeah, really that's funny. pretty crazy. Yeah, that would be amazing. They kind of look like that when they first come out. Yeah. yeah. Uh big, <laughs> 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 big belly thirteen just says poop. That is an amazing, amazing yeah. post. <laughs> <laughs> Poop. <laughs> Poop. He's got one of those bellies, the fronts that looks like a guy's face. Yeah, he's got a talker. Yeah, yeah, he's got a big time talker. Yeah, Poop. I could have a conversation with that if I was tired enough. <laughs> and he, you know, he's making it say "poop." <laughs> <laughs> Poop. Yeah, he looks like he's halfway through the O's. Yeah, yeah. he's doing the Ace Ventura butt talking with his belly. Yeah. yeah. Um, fatten me to death. PA is back oh, here. Yeah. Anyone on here good with computers? Having a few <laughs> issues. I need a man who will tie me to the bed, put a feeding tube in me, turn it on, and never turn it off. He's so needy, this guy. He needs yeah. people to fix his computer, True. turn him into oh, a... Fatten me all the way to death. Yeah. Fat me, oh, fat me to death. But first, can you fix my c- computer? I don't know how to connect my printer. Um, Chubby Beer Belly says, <laughs> Muse was phenomenal last night. If people can't see, he has a slice of pizza hidden under his tit. Oh, my God. That is unreal. Yeah, that's a photo of him at the Muse concert. Yeah. <laughs> um, Fat me to death. Either I'm pregnant, have a parasite in me, or I'm eating too much. Can't figure it out yet. <laughs> hmm, I'm guessing parasite. Yeah, I'm not sure which it could be. Uh, keep the food coming says, does anyone else have a physical ick that you dislike? For me, it's mullets. I don't get them, <laughs> and I very rarely see people look good with them. Here's some people's icks on uh-huh. Grommer. Okay. Uh, nose rings. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Beards. Okay. 
Wearing unnatural colored contacts unironically. Wow. <laughs> okay, that one, actually, I do agree with that. Yeah, yeah that one, no, I, I, I do agree, agree with, with that. that, too. And the mullets, actually, too. Yeah, actually, all these are pretty... Yeah, actually, they're pretty, pretty, really yeah. all pretty disgusting. Um, Lil One says, the inner battle of wanting to be the biggest? We're making him the biggest. Damn. So this is kind of shows that it's like a power... Str- it can be He's a power a, this struggle. Is a, this is a, a flex, sort of flex... It could be a feedy, could be a feeder. Right? Yeah. He does both. Uh huh. Wow. But it's also like, you know, it's like something where you imagine, like, oh my God, what if my spouse got famous and they left me behind? Uh-huh. It's like, what if my boyfriend, yeah. he grew to 700 pounds and I'm stuck back at 400? True. It's hard. That's, you know, hard yeah. for us because we're all dating. Maybe we're trying to be all celebrities. Exactly. Yeah. So yeah. I'm just saying yeah. the celebrity lifestyle is pretty similar it's kinda, to the yeah, feeder, yeah. To the feeder lifestyle. lifestyle. And trust I just wanted me, to point that out. They were not all that different. From I'm, as soon as I get. My celebrity, my celebrity feeder stuff. She is not coming with me. Oh no, I'm dropping her. Uh-huh. Yeah. No, they're gonna pick me up in a forklift <laughs> yeah. and take me out of that <laughs> house. Yeah. Uh, Thomas the Twunk Engine DMing my first D and D campaign today, hoping for the best. Is that patches, good yeah. for them. Yeah, good patches. Be, it kind of does look like patches' <laughs> body a little bit. I'll never know. Uh, why am I still meal prepping when some scientist could be turning me into a growing <laughs> test subject? <laughs> okay, definitely patches. He's talking yeah. about yeah. nerd stuff now. That is such. A, that's just such a funny. Uh, uh, what does that have to do with meal <laughs> prepping? <laughs> um, here's someone's bio. Okay. And this is what I'm talking about: people who are breakers. They like to break stuff. Okay. Um, these are a few of my favorite experiences: being told I'm too fat to top because, quote, my back can't handle the weight of your belly. Whoa. Hearing a reinforced stool creak under your weight, unable to access the attic due to low capacity ladar, being unable to reach up because your shirt will become untucked, hearing the sigh from a fellow plane passenger as they sit down <laughs> next to you, being unable to recline a movie theater chair because your thigh won't let off the up button, <laughs> pretending to be too cool for school because spirit clothes don't come in your size, being called plump by a partner as they lose interest from your gains, wondering if the bar chair will hold your weight choosing a booth because that chair looks flimsy choosing a table because that booth looks too narrow choosing to eat at all times whenever you can and all you can it did seem a little when i was reading all this shit it does seem like a little bit of an appealing lifestyle oh yeah. like, absolutely you literally are you just do what you want you're like yeah. a sim like you're so aware of your meter just like ice cream yeah. every day descending like it's amazing you are go- you're godzilla yeah. you get to make you you like like all of those like foods that they make on like the subway ads that are like stupid yeah. as shit where it's like, oh, we're going to put like, we're going to make an egg tornado with like whipped cream on it. That is your breakfast, lunch, and dinner. It sounds fucking dope. It actually. does sound yeah. incredible. Um, never enough. What's the craziest thing you've done to game? Enrolled in a two year degree program. Knowing when I finish, I'll get a raise that will 100% go towards <laughs> food. <laughs> wow. <laughs> um, Shotha says, I think that they should make bathroom scales, which speak your weight at 80 plus decibels for gainers, which is a cool invention idea. And 80 decibels, um, it can damage your hearing if you're exposed <laughs> to it for too long. It's about the <laughs> level of a busy downtown street. So it's because you can't see the thing. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So you would have it. So you, it would have it just I'm yell just so loud. 80 plus decibels. I looked at 80 plus decibels. Literally, is the threshold for ear damage. That's like, <laughs> like exactly where it is. Like imagine, like you live next door to a gainer in like a house with paper thin walls, and they have yeah. that fucking scale. And you're you're just yeah. eating breakfast one day, and you hear just like four hundred fifty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, then, th- and then ten minutes later, you hear four hundred and fifty five pounds. <laughs> 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 um, you then, yeah, like they just hear a guy just come. Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you weigh four hundred and eighty pounds. <laughs> this next four hundred four seventy nine. This. <laughs> This next thing, I discovered a thing that I did not even <laughs> consider could be part of this website. Yeah, and this is th- this is the craziest thing to me. Is a one pound cup shot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we all have those sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> you got to be a gainer to I have one of those. Probably the bigger you are, the more the bigger your nut. <laughs> yeah, is, right. One hundred percent. No, it's because when he when he <laughs> he's shitting when he's shitting. Oh, he's shitting as he's jizzing. That's gross. That's Come not true, yeah. man. What Dude, the fuck is wrong with you? That, that, that was floor. funny was on to YouTube, me. man. That was Shit funny and to me. jizz, bro. Um, let me read you guys yeah. this new corner uh-huh. of the website. Uh, this is from J Belly Lover. Any preds, oh, which wow. is short for predators, yeah. want to vore me? Turn me into a pole of meaty sludge digesting in your gut and then turn me into shit in your toilet. Might even have a few trophies you can take. Hashtag vore. And Holy. I know you guys are wondering what that guy's profile picture is. Uh-huh. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's a centaur that's standing on his high leg, hind legs, and he's really fat. But only the horse belly is fat, and the human body is really buff. Wow! <laughs> How does that make any sense? 
Yeah, that um, it's really good. Would they both be fat? <laughs> Would it be a fat horse? Why is the body still buff? It's really funny. <laughs> yeah, I really like this picture a lot. <laughs> that is really no good. Yeah, how do you stand up like sense. that? It, <laughs> why would the horse belly get fat? And not the why would the whole guy be fat? Twink ninety nine says, <laughs> Pray, come on out, come or come out, come out, wherever you are, and then Tasty Snack Boy says, Sounds like a trap. I'll oh my god. <laughs> Wait, oh my god, Leprechaun like this. <laughs> Damn. No, he and nommed this. I am your prey, noms this. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Um, yeah, but uh, sounds like a trap. I'll stay hidden. Was really making me yeah. laugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Swallow me whole says, "Are there any preds out there that feel like slowly and brutally mulching up a prey in their hairy <laughs> guts, where no one but you can hear my whimpers or see my struggles?" Colin Pete, dude, it's crazy. Yeah, I'm just sticking your tongue out. Uh, I'm goofy. I want to be I'm eaten alive. <laughs> <laughs> um, satisfied Belch says. The urge to sneak up behind an unsuspecting prey boy and swallow him down in front of his friends and family is growing. Oh my Satisfied God. belch. Dude. Satisfied belch. I don't want to nom that. I would not nom that. No, no I would nom not nom that. A prey boy. God you like prey damn. boys. Me? Yeah. This is no, the I would I think I probably am a prey boy. Yeah, you kind of are This is a like the crazy right? I didn't I'm know a, that this I'm like one of those. Thing. I'm like one of those perfectly smooth uh, Japanese cakes that people like so much. Yeah. So I'm like that to it. Yeah, I'm you like are, that, right? Yeah. I just have no nothing on me. Um, Zach Autumn Runner said, <laughs> "It's too hot. Can I put you in the freezer for a bit and then lick you like an ice lolly?" This this is like like I I can get behind like the guys who are just like feeders, like the guys who are just like oh like. I want to be like the biggest fucking fattest. You think it's asshole. wrong to freeze someone and lick them like an ice lolly? You think that's wrong? This is their lifestyle. <laughs> this is their sexuality. Yeah. Who are you to judge? You know what? You made a good You're point. like J.K. Rowling. You know what? Yeah. You know what? I'm being a furf. Yeah, you, you are. are. I'm being a fucking furf. Um, and now we're gonna end here with some some nice motivation <laughs> from Shota. I just have a few messages from him. Okay. That Aww. kind of this can can send us They're off into the rest of the week, and we'll feel good, All and right. we'll be happy, and yeah, we'll have some this some, is some, some mantras we can repeat. This is to what ourselves. I need right now. Um, and this is from Shota. Mm. First one: Dreams can come true. It depends on how much you want them to come true. Aww. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. That is sweet. Second one. Thank you for the encouraging comment on my photo. I'll always have room in my Aww, belly for you. The. I'm going to so. start using that for you guys. And I now the always last have one. room in my Let's belly Let's bring this energy too. into the rest of the week, guys. Uh, come to New Zealand. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll eat you. <laughs> <laughs> and that's wow. all I got. Yeah. Dude. That was an amazing Shota. We this is definitely. I'd like I to mean, talk to Shota again sometime soon. In, yeah. in turn, like he's a good guy. And we've we've you know studied the diaper people. Yes. Yeah. What else have we looked up? Like just other weird things. Other weird. Mostly I think weird this stuff. this these this community seems like they seem nice. They seem very nice and they seem very loving to I, each I other. And I, they just want like I'll say I don't like the I don't like the guys who want to eat meaty sludges of other guys. Yeah, I don't think that, that, that those guys that's what I mean I mean guys like Shotha. Shotha's nice does, though. He yeah. does it he he's, does it he respectably. Nice. Yeah. These guys are great. I don't like the people who call themselves <laughs> predators. And they want it's to really bad they want to yeah. sneak up behind well, that's, somebody. Well uh, that's probably and why they say like preds. A cobra. So yeah. they don't say it, my yeah, true. my thing my sexual thing is I'm a predator. Yeah. <laughs> they know yeah, I'm a prey. I guess that's fair. No, you don't understand. I'm not like a sexual assault or anything. I just like to eat guys. <laughs> no, I just I like to slurp. most people I like to eat, eat them, them and digest, digest them. them. Yeah. Yeah. In front of their friends and family. <laughs> no, it's no, I'm a good in guy. Front of their whole I'm not a family, predator. Their wife and kids. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna unhinge my jaw like a cobra. I don't ghost women. I just eat guys. Uh, thank you. Uh huh. Thank you for watching. Um, if you um want to come see me blah, in blah, Boston blah, 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 on blah, blah, the 16th, blah, opening blah, for Connor blah, O'Malley. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, tickets are available tickets at pornhub.com. Yeah, go to uh, connorxvideos.com slash Connor shit, O'Malley. Fuck you, bitch ass motherfucker. Fuck you. And Bye. if you want to see Caleb open for for I'm gonna, uh, you want to see me and open if you want to see asshole. me open my mouth and eat Caleb, then you should subscribe you should to the go. Patreon because uh -huh. I'll be doing that this week. Bye. Be a shareholder meeting. Oh, wait. Uh, we have that schedule? When did we say? What day is it, Jubio? The 22nd. You guys are trying to. We have stuff we yeah, have Yeah, Wednesday the 22nd. We have an obligation. March to 22nd. Plug that's things. the next shareholder meeting. So make sure we you subscribe to the Patreon and, and uh, join the Discord because that's where the, uh -huh. it's held. All right. All right see right, you thanks there. Thanks, everybody. Bye. Bye. You need to change this camera. <laughs>